Hey everyone, so this video is about a complete your small tooth replacement kit that I purchased from Amazon. Good morning, good afternoon, how are you guys doing? I purchased this instant smile tooth replacement kit from Amazon and I did decide to get the deluxe pack which includes extra temporary replacement beads and also has four shades of teeth. Along with that, it does come with some scissors, a filing tool, and it also does come with extra replacement beads. You can also purchase the $21 kit, which does not come with as many beads, but it definitely will suffice. This is the tooth that broke off, which was a crown and not a veneer. These are all the items that come with your purchase or your replacement kit. If you decide to get the deluxe kit, you will have extra beads. It does come with four different shades of teeth, so that way you can choose the right one. You will need a cup of hot water to make sure that the beads melt and also a, a spoon to scoop them out with. I totally advise you using a mirror to find the perfect spot for your tooth. So now I'm just going to go ahead and choose the shades. Now, as I stated, this was a crown that I had. It was in my mouth for about six to seven years and it broke off. All of my teeth on the top are crowns, not veneers, but crowns. And so I was really distraught about losing this tooth. Now that I found my shade, I think this one lines perfectly. I'm not going for that super bright white because I want it to look natural and realistic. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take a pair of tweezers that I decided to use and I'm going to cut the perfect tooth. And I'm just going to make sure that it fits in properly. And while I'm doing that, I'm going to boil my water and I'm also going to take my tweezer and hold on to the tooth and just file it down just a little bit so that it fits properly. Now, here we have our boiling water and I'm going to place some of those beads in the, um, the cup. As you guys see, the beads did turn clear. And once you will see them turn clear, just kind of like scoop them together like so. Be very careful because your water is super hot. And once you've gotten out that glob of melted beads, you then want to carefully separate it. You do not need to use all of it, but you need to use some of it. Now, I do think you can reuse the globs that you didn't use. Now, here's the number one thing. Do not smear the back of that molding on the tooth until you have the tooth inserted. So my suggestion would be to make sure you put a nice glob in the middle of the tooth. And once you have placed it in your mouth, that is when you're going to use your thumb to smear the molding on the back of your tooth and upwards. So that way it will fit properly. They do suggest drinking a cup of cold water. I would suggest allowing it to stay in your mouth for at least an hour. At least that's what it took for me. Okay guys, so this is the end results. This is the very next day. I wanted to make sure that it was comfortable and that it fit properly prior to finishing up the video. I wanted to see how it felt wearing it and just give you my thoughts. So the one thing that I will tell you guys, you definitely need to make sure that you're not overdoing the back of the putty onto the tooth. My mistake was putting the putty on the back and flattening and trying to spread it out before putting it in my mouth. So the one thing that you need to do, which is very crucial, very important, when putting the putty on the back of the tooth, just put it directly in the middle of the tooth, put enough. And then once you get it into your mouth, that is when you're going to take your thumb or your finger and spread it around, spreading it to the back of your teeth so that it'll hook on. My mistake was spreading it out and it started to, the putty started to get on the sides of the tooth and under the tooth, which was making it impossible for me to insert. So you just want to put a glob of it on the back just directly on the back. And then once you slip it up, that's when you start to mold it with your thumb and maybe even your tongue. Now they do say you can drink some cold water to help make the putty freeze and harden, but they also do say it'll take five minutes for the putty to harden and mold into your mouth. That part is not true. It took about an hour and a half for it to harden and mold in my mouth. So during that time, I just was making sure that the putty was straight and I just left it in my mouth. The, the important thing for me is to leave it in my mouth. In about an hour and a half, it became very hard to where I didn't have to worry about it. It didn't stick on to my teeth, like meaning I, I was I was able to easily pull it out. Uh, as you see right here, this is the front of the tooth right here. And if you see, mine has like these two little arrows or horns sticking out. That's the actual putty. And that's fine because once I insert it, it kind of like covers a little bit of air gaps or what have you. But this is the back and this is what it looks like after it molded to my mouth. And I just slip it in. 
It doesn't wiggle. It doesn't move. Have I eaten with it? I did remove it when it was time to eat. Um, I don't really think that you can eat with it. It would probably be a hard task depending on you as a person. I did. I was able to chew gum. I was able to chew gum with it. Yeah, this is just be like a replacement for me until my uh, partials are ready. I do have to get those made this week. So I didn't want to walk around without it, without my tooth in the front. I do have one on the side, two more on the side that are missing. So for those all the way on the side, I'm not really too concerned about it. But this one right here, definitely a game changer. And the colors, the shades, the shade that I chose was Dead Smack On. It was a perfect shade. And I did have to, you know, file it down, but that's okay. It came out really, really well. And I like the, um, I like the actual fit of it. In the beginning, um, my gums were a little bit unused to it, but as the day progressed, it worked out for me. So yeah, I would highly recommend this product. So 